Hey, orange one here. So we have been, um, I've taken care of a few things between the, when I was last recording and now. So we're kind of on this part of the map right here. Um, the doctor's office that we had been going to, I believe, is like right around here or something. Yeah, so it's like pretty far away. We've cleared out a lot of that city though, like kind of down there, so we actually don't need to get that far to get to where we've kind of cleared out. And I did kind of want to make my way towards the library, um, slash get more bleach for making more mutagen. And also, I you know, I feel like you're not going to believe me, but check out the CBM that I got um, from a shocker zombie. Yeah, that's right. We've basically entered the late game. So I'm I'm pretty excited about that, but um, I think for now what I was doing was um, kind of getting my mood up and healing up just a little bit, slash doing some crafting. Oh my gosh, that was like the quickest game ever of Robot Finds Kitten. Well, I'm fine with that. Um, can I? Ignore the zombie. I think they're coming towards me because I'm playing my harmonica. Um, oh, I also wanted to show you this. This is pretty sweet. Check this out. Um, this coil gun, we can use sustainably. So I don't really need to be doing this because I'm actually healed up quite nicely. But let's just let the zombie get a little bit closer. Yeah. Good. And so I've actually only got um, nails in this thing, but what I've found is that if I kill zombies, I'll occasionally get some batteries, and then I can use those batteries to charge up my, um, my battery system. And then I can use said battery system to um, uh, get UPS power from, and then the coil gun is running off of my internal power, which I'm getting from random batteries that I'm finding around. That's basically been... I've been just kind of playing around with that for like the last like day or so in-game. Um, it's working pretty nicely. And I think that we could use that as a semi-sustainable way of uh, getting stronger. Yeah, we're, we're apparently really tired, but... I'm just going to try and heal up to like full health and then we might do some some looting. If not full health, I think we're close enough when we're done reading this uh, and getting our trapping up, then I think we might go in. We are also dead tired, which is going to be kind of a problem. But if we're, if we're installing another CBM, I think that'd be fine. Actually, you know what we could do? Make some coffee. I think I might actually already have some coffee around, so I just want to check that first. Any coffee. Um, just coffee powder. Okay. Well, let's make some coffee. Make four servings, and then we'll... Because I don't want to sleep right now. I think I just want to get in the city. It, we're no longer tired. I think I... I'm going to leave that at that. And maybe drive in a little bit. So th there's something weird that's going on with like the opening and closing of these windows that makes it so that now when I try and open, these aren't appearing to be an option to open. And I have to like press, um, what is it, 8 to go down and that will open them. It's, kinda, it's, it's annoying. Not a huge issue, but it is definitely annoying. Oh no, I just ran over some chocolate candies. I know how am I going to live with myself. Right? Um, I think I'm just gonna leave that eternal zombie. I did want to loot these houses though, so let's just slow it down a little bit. If the zombie comes to me, then I'm not gonna do anything, but we'll see. We'll close that. I think I already walked through here, yeah, because I already grabbed some of the nails. I don't think I got all the nails. Uh, has that shocker seen me? No, they have not. Is that a military vehicle that's right by them? I think it was. 
Uh, uh, sure, let's just get this out. I just don't want to get hit by a shocker. It's apparently downed. I don't know why it's down. That's kind of weird. They're no longer downed. Whatever had them down, they're back up. Okay, they're dead. Good. And then... I'm actually going to get the Jane out. Uh, drop the gun. Just because I know we're going to have to uh, deal with these zombies. Oh, actually, these corpses aren't... Uh, aren't smashed. So let's just take a second and smash those before they all get up. I think an ant or something must have killed them. Yeah, we do have a backpack on, but as long as we don't have a backpack and a gun, I think that we're fairly maneuverable. I can't leave this gun here, though. Let's just pick it up for now. It's fine. Where's that corrosive zombie? Oh, there's actually quite a few of them over there. Have I already cleared out this area? I might have cleared out this area. No, it looks like there's a good amount of them just uh, to the south. They're not making their way over here, though, so I think that we're kind of okay. I'm okay enough, I think, to get to that military vehicle. And get, like, those bullets off the ground, because that is probably, just from looking at it, gonna be a good thing to get. Yeah, dude. 40, 40 military rounds, I'll take that. Um... Okay, you're going to be annoying, yeah. Ignore, and now I'm all confused. Might as well shoot you while I'm confused. Come on, there we go. And now I've been spat on, and I'm disoriented, so great. Okay, let's just take a couple steps back. Oh my god, he just threw up on me again. I just got my vision back and then he just threw up on me again. What a meanie. Well, I'm gonna just run away a little bit then. Hopefully get my vision back. And... Don't you dare throw up on me. There we go. I'm just gonna keep on laying down fire like that. And the nadir is... Probably, this isn't going to do much to you. Actually, you know what? I think that this is good for my aim. So, thank you for the experience. I learned a lot. Um, is that corrosive? Can I hit them with this? I can, nice. They are actually shooting at me, though. Okay, our coil gun is getting a little low. So you're seeing the one problem with this is that the damage output is um, it's problematic. Like, I'm actually doing a decent amount, but okay, this guy is getting annoying. I don't like the corrosive ones. Just drop that coil gun for a second. Yeah. There's tons of, uh, whatchamacallit, nails around us, so I'm not really worried about the ammo. But yeah, let's just take care of the devourer. I just don't want to deal with it, to be completely honest. They're just kind of an annoying enemy to fight. Uh, let's smash that. I feel like the other guy is going to sneak up on me while I'm trying to smash this corpse. I think 55 seconds, yeah, he's got to get to me. Um, oh, he did not, but this Devourer almost did. There we go, here down. And... The Ethereal, I'm gonna... Go out on a limb here. And try and fight you without my backpack. 
I, I'm just looking at the amount of health, health that we have, and I'm not too concerned about this. Uh, we could get our adrenaline going, but I don't think that I want to. I'm gonna do a little bit of sensory dulling, though. Mostly because, yeah, we're gonna get a little hurt here. If I look at you health-wise, yeah, you're, you're pretty, much, pretty much down. Okay. Go ahead and get that backpack back on. The gun. And I think that, uh, I just want to double check corpses around here, but I'm pretty sure that we're in the clear. Uh, let's also just see if there's a battery here that I can consume. I actually have plenty of battery power. Um, why don't we just get those shelled nuts? That's that's gonna be some good calories for us. Is that that's a hellhound coming our way? Okay, wield that. Get the sword away. Probably one of my least favorite enemies. Okay, I think it's down. Maybe not. Uh, nope. He's he's still there. Still coming. There we go. Well worth it to not get burned clothes, in my opinion. I'm sure others would disagree, but... Uh, just drop it. Like I said earlier, we have... A good amount of ammo. Um, what's with the smoke that's over there, though? Is that a smoker? I think it's a smoker. Given the cloud is just kind of coming our way. Uh, that brute is gonna punch me. Can I avoid them in the smoke? No, I can't. Okay, well, dang. I think we're gonna want to hit you with the rail, uh, whatchamacallit. Let's just, uh, pull him up a little bit here. Oh, there's a nadir here as well. Okay, well, that's not really what I want to do. Um,. I do have two steel rails with me, so I think that we'd be okay. Given that I have also the bolt driver, yeah, we're fine. Let's do the bolt driver first. Keep that with you. I don't want to lose that. Okay, this is killing the nadir pretty nicely. There we go. Okay, they're both down. Uh, there's a devourer though that's coming our way, and I'm out of bolts. Okay, that means it's time for this. I think we're okay. Yeah, we should be fine to, to shoot you. Oh wow, he actually survived that. Huh. That, what? Headshot, but you've got like full health. Okay. Let's just get behind this stuff that's gonna make him go a little slower. Ignore, reload, hit him again. What is happening? Okay, I think I'm gonna need to... He might be devouring items, but I didn't see it, like a message or anything about that. So I'm gonna try and walk away from you and see how fast you are compared to me and see if I can get back to my gun. Not at this pace, but we should be able to avoid you from running. Let's open that up and try and get you to go in there. Yeah, <laughs> that should slow you down. Okay, I'm happy with that. Just walk a little bit. I'm going to break line of sight with you. And go into my car, maybe? 
I mean, I could easily get into the car and gather our stamina and get our bolts, or we could go for a gun. The more safe option is to go into our car. Because I'm a coward. Um, back it up just a little bit. We'll, we'll get our gun. I'm just going to make a note that we're leaving the gun there. Just back it up a little bit. Uh, and I want to go to the side there just a little bit. And then, oh, maybe, um, maybe we're good here. Yeah, I think that this is fine here. Um, can I close that? Yes, I can. And they are probably going to make their way towards us, but let's just reload the butterfly. And if there's any other rails, I'm just going to grab those. Um, I'm just going to get like two more. That should be good. We really should make more of those. The military pilot is there. Um, let's go deal with them. Let's go activate the Jane. We'll get the butterfly away for now. We will deal with the devourer. I just kind of want to take care of our six while we can easily. Um, backpack, put that down. Nice. Oh, we can actually, we don't even have to wear the backpack. Okay. Well, that's because we're not carrying our gun, huh? Um. That devourer is annoying, but the nadir, I bet we can we can take out that nadir. Um, maybe turn that off for now. And I we could have actually put those bolts in our bolt driver. I just don't want to wait for it. If I'm completely honest, that's uh, it's just um. Make things a little interesting. We'll just play a little tune while that nadir comes towards us. And we're gonna, gonna play a little game. Instead of ring around the roses, it's a uh, ring around the zombies. Just run a little bit further back. And let's get that butterfly out. We, we just played our little jig. Um. I would like to just keep that with us because I'm afraid I'm going to forget it. And we'll let you get real close and then I'm going to hit you with this when I got a guaranteed headshot. There we go. That pretty much killed you. If I go to the broadhead... Uh... Wait, what? What happened there? I'm, I'm so confused. I mean, the headshot almost killed him, and then, what, he received, like, shrapnel or something? Not sure what happened. In any case, this should be reloaded. Wait, I thought... Oh, I must have put them, like, on the ground or something. Yep. Whoops. My bad. Oh, we actually have 14 of those. Okay, so we're, we're totally fine. Let's go get our gun, and then we'll kill that devourer that's in the car. It's stuck in the car. Oh, he's no longer stuck in the car. Okay. Well, actually, if I have the rails, maybe I should just shoot you with the rails. There we go. Nice and sustainable, too. Uh, there's a shambler that's coming my way. There's something in that smoke. Um, not really sure what it is, but I would like to get near my gun. Maybe stop running. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's a smoker. I just would like to have the gun if uh, before I, I find out for sure. Hey, ethereal zombie, you're really gonna do this. Okay, um, hold on. 
Let's just get some better aim. I think we can one-shot him. Oh, actually, what's that? Oh, no. Okay, we're going to definitely want to have our military-grade gun out for that. While I've got the aim, though, let's just kill the ethereal one. There we go. I'm going to be about picking up that gun that's on the floor there. Hopefully it's not too uh, many moves. It's two moves. That is a tank that's coming my way, so I think that we're okay. Okay. Yes, we are okay. But we are definitely not in a good situation. With the adrenal, adrenal pump, I think we're okay. I just need to keep my distance from said tank. So definitely have that back on. Run over here. And I'm going to try first killing this acidic zombie and then trying to kite the other ones over him. Nor. Uh, I'm just nervous about that thing being that close to me, if I'm completely honest. And I'm curious to see what my speed is like compared to it. Okay. Definitely faster than I would like, but if I dive through a building, I think I might be able to lose it. If I need to. Um, I've forgotten how many bullets it took last time to kill one of these things. But it's probably going to punch me. I just need to be anticipating that. Okay, 100 damage. Um, seems to have uh, left an impact. If I look at aiming at you... Oh, there's uh, there's some electricity down south. That could end very badly. So I, I'm trying to hit you like three, four times. I think we're going to want the adrenal BBM. That's, yeah, let's uh, take some steps back here. Okay, um... I think I'm okay. I'm not happy about the spacing that I'm getting, but I think it'll work. That dog is also pretty fast, but not my priority right now. Okay, that was a waste of a bullet. <laughs> kind of. Um, okay, get that adrenal pump going. We need a little uh, kick in the in the pants, as they say. Okay, we got some good terrain between us. I think we can finish you. There's a skeletal juggernaut, too. Man. Come on, Kata. I love you, too. <laughs> um, come on. How's your health now? Yeah, I think two shots from now and you should be good. You're about to punch me. Oh no. No. Okay, let's just take a shot and see if we get lucky, because I think we need to. Let you get... Oh, what? He attacked me from a distance. I'm on the floor. Okay, we're about to get punched. Yep, I knew it. Okay, it's not as bad as I thought it might be. We're not in pain, so I think we're okay. Because of our adrenaline, we're not going to be in pain. But it's going to hurt real bad when that wears off. Um, and we probably want to make our way to the car as well. Okay, let's kill the dog. Just gonna reassess right here. Uh, can I light that guy on fire? I can. Okay. Skeletal shocker. Um. Nope. 
not not looking to fight that. Uh, go ahead, reload. Ignore. Just uh, yeah, put it in my inventory. We can we can spare that much time. There's quite a few of them to our right, though. So we want to make our way to the car. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna walk, and I think we should be able to out uh, maneuver that group that we are gonna have to take out the feral. Okay, I think yeah, we're doing all right. I think we'll get out of here. That group, I don't think, is following us. I think the smoke. Whatever the zombie is that's got the smoke around them is trapped in that car. Whatever it is. Okay. We are back at the car. Relatively safe. Our torso is still hurting. Um, yeah, let's, let's just heal that up a little bit. I'm just gonna look around the back. Make sure we're clear. Yeah, we look like we're okay. Okay, go ahead and just drop the gun for now. Definitely gonna hang out by it though. Okay, just wait here so you get your breath back. There's other zombies that come, I wanna know. No, we're good. Besides, you know, being in massive amounts of pain. But luckily, our body, um, we can't really feel that pain. <laughs> Um, okay, here we go. Get this reloaded too. Yeah, we, we're down to, what was that, under 300 bullets now? Get that Jane away. We'll get that ammo away. Uh, we should also probably dump some of this stuff that we don't really need. But we should also... Eh. I'll keep the, the shelled peanuts on us. That's a good little snack for us. We should also get the bolt driver out. And reload that. We have the bolts, you know. Which we don't. We only had four. But that's better than nothing. That's four more bolts than what we had. And I also want to get some nails. So it's, a, it's just tear apart like this fence. Uh, go ahead, get the Jane out. I think we'll probably have some better tools here. But this is easy. And we have, like, decent enough strength to do this easily. And look at that, we almost have, like, a full thing of nails. Just by smashing, like, this fence. So we can pretty sustainably do that. I just need to find like a fence to destroy every once in a while. Let's have some root beer. Yeah, and some peanuts. Go for it. Okay, and then I think, yeah. What I probably should do is clear out those zombies and kill that shocker. I definitely am gonna head back to where those zombies were because I think we, we got a job to finish. Eventually. Okay, get some antiseptic on the body parts. Our essential and bandage that torso because I'm not liking the looking the like of that. I'm sure, bandage that right arm as well. Um, that shambler's kind of hanging about. I'm just gonna smash what it lets me right now smash and then we'll we'll deal with the others soon that acidic one we do want to take care of though um yeah that one that's shambling is kind of looking at me but i think we're okay yeah we're fine well whatever's causing the smoke i think i want to deal with it yeah, why don't you turn that off? Let's get this on and... Oh, actually the coil gun. Can I... 
wield that and reload it. Nice. Okay, so that's nice and reloaded. We are feeling awful, though. So I do need to keep that in mind. And now we are going to be going into being completely blind. Zombie Ichus. Uh, that I do not like the sound of. From what I remember, those are actually kind of a nasty enemy. I have, like, pretty high armor. It saw us, so it should be coming towards us. I think it saw us, at least. I'm not really sure. I mean, we could throw in, uh, like, a grenade or something. I might do that. Um, Skeletal Shocker, Juggernaut. Yeah, I think... I'm going to end this here, and, and we'll fight those guys um, in the next episode. If I can smash that corpse of that tank, I, I want to do that. But I don't think we're going to be able to. There's just too many of them around right now. Okay, yeah. I'm going to end this here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.